Okay, question number eight is to draw a graph representing Zendaya's workout where it's like a hit workout. So she's running and then she's jogging and then she's sprinting and then she's walking. So let's talk about the graph I've made first. Um, on this axis, this is the VO2 and it's measured in liters per minute. On this x-axis, this is time in minutes. It goes from zero to 20. And then on this axis is the speed that she's gonna be moving at. So it'll go between zero and 10 miles an hour. 10 miles an hour being very fast, very high intensity. So when she first starts going, I will be referencing this a little bit just cause like it's the prompts. Um, she's gonna be starting, you always have a little bit of VO2 going. Like you, it takes energy to like just be living, right? Um, that's like your basal metabolic rate. But um, she's gonna warm up at three miles an hour um, for five minutes. So here's five minutes right here. Let's draw this. So it's gonna take a few minutes for her body to adjust, but then she's gonna, oh, sorry, too far. She's gonna get up. She's just chilling. She's just warming up. And then for 60 seconds at a very high intensity, she's gonna be sprinting. So here's this one minute. And again, it takes her body a little bit. It's not like it's gonna go straight up. She's gonna go up and she's gonna be sprinting. This is her 60 second sprint at 10 miles an hour. And then she's gonna walk again at three miles an hour. Boom, three, four, five more minutes. So here we are at 11 minutes. Boom, she's gonna come back down. Maybe this should be a little bit lower. This should be at three miles an hour. Hold on, I need to find two. She's going at three miles an hour for five more minutes. And then she's gonna sprint again for another minute at 10 miles an hour. She's gonna go up, boom, 10. And then she's gonna come back down for five more minutes. One, two, three, four. Boom. Chilling. Sprints at 10 miles an hour for 60 seconds, walks, and then after that, she's done. But your body does not just go straight back down. It's a gradual descent back down to zero. This right here, this is Zendaya's epoch. So excess post oxygen. Um, I just like the amount, what, what does it actually say for? Excess post-oxygen, um, oh my gosh, don't give me a bad grade for this, please. It's the, like, it's why you're still breathing heavy, it's why you're still sweating, it's why your heart is still beating so fast, it's your epoch. Your excess post <laughs> Excess post-exercise oxygen consumption. Consumption, that was the word. Um, and then right here on this side, like while your body's building up, so all of this, this is your O2 deficit. And your O2 deficit is when um, your body needs more energy for the movement than how much you're consuming. And that's why, like, this is your body warming up. So then you'd have another mini, like, really tiny, skinny O2 deficit here, and a little tiny little epoch here for every jump. Um, but just imagine that, like, <laughs> I kind of drew it a little bit wrong. So these points where she's stopping at, that's three miles an hour. And then up here, this is 10. Power. And that's a graph of Zendaya's workout. <laughs>